This demonstration shows that melting ice in water does not cause the water level to rise. You can clearly see what happens when you put water into a closed container and leave it in the freezer. When it turns from water into ice, it expands and in this case breaks the container. And I have a little blue iceberg here that I'm going to float in a volume of water. And by the way, icebergs have a bluish tint because ice tends to absorb a little bit of a longer wavelength like uh, towards the red end of the spectrum and so what's left is blue. I'm going to fill this up to nearly overflow up, capsize the iceberg. Okay, settle down. I'm going to fill this up to nearly overflowing. And what might be surprising to some of you is that as the ice melts, the volume does not increase of the ice-water combination. And so none of the water will spill out. And that makes sense if you realize that as the water melts, its density increases because it's turning back into liquid water. And so it all makes nice mathematical and physical sense. So we'll just let it sit there for a while and we can watch it on the clock. Water is the only material that occurs naturally on Earth in all three forms, gas, liquid, and solid. Okay, so here the ice is gone and we've got no spillage whatsoever. Thank you and come back for another Dr. C.